Welcome back to the pregame show here on the NECBL Broadcast Network. Nick Bell here with Hayden Jones. Hell, Hayden, two for four Monday night. Uh, what was working for you? Oh, you know, just staying through the ball, biggest thing, and getting back on that back toe, really big thing, and that's the biggest part that I've been needing to get through my game that I've been missing out on a little bit through the summer, and, you know, getting that feeling back is the best thing that I've been able to feel through the, it all. Now, Hayden, I saw a highlight on, on, I think it was Facebook, of your first home run, uh, your college career. So take us through that at bat. I mean, you launched the thing oh, yeah. out of the park. Uh, you know, how are you feeling? Take us through that. Oh, it was, I mean, I got my, my first at bat in college. It was, I ended up striking out, but I ended up almost having to get stitches on my nose, took out the Wi-Fi box. But, uh, no, that that bat being the first hit in my college career was big, the, one of the base things. And, you know, guy put down the middle. I don't remember swinging. I don't remember even what pitch it was. It just probably the farthest ball I hit, though. And that, it was just – you know, I ran, touched second, and the lights start going, and it was just, uh, it was electric. It was unbelievable, the feeling and everything like that. And so you kind of touched on it before. So what is one thing you're trying to work on here in Newport? Um, you know, just getting back to, uh, the, you know, back to my normal play, how I used to play coming out of high school, and how you know all the scouts saw me, and how all the college coaches saw me as the player I was, and you know, out of college, you know, playing at the beginning of the season, DHing uh, the rest of the season. And not knowing like when you were going to go in or whatnot, being the freshman, typical, and uh, you know just being in the typical the day to day basis, and knowing you're playing every single day is it's a lot better feeling. And so it's you know just getting the swings and receiving and just getting the stress of the game put back on you, so you get the feel of it. It's a lot. It helps out a lot. So you guys tonight are in second place. You're game out of second place. If you win tonight, you're a half game out. So what's the general vibe of the team right now? You know we're all just. I don't think anyone really thinks about it or anything like that. They just go out and do their thing. Um, you know, we got a dude on the mound in Dylan, and he's going to do his thing, and we got a defense behind him, and we're going to swing the bass for him, and that's the biggest thing that we got going for us right now. So I've heard a, a little bit about a riff you have with our broadcaster, Stephen Huff, and how he doesn't get you on camera as much. So it's now that you're on camera. What do you have to say to Stephen? And it's just about time. I mean, I guess I, I get the better half of the interviewer now today, so some way he finally wants to do it, but no, he – I love, love the guys here, and they do a great job. So it's awesome here. Thank you, Hayden. We appreciate it. And last question. Uh, so what have you enjoyed about your time here in Newport? Ooh, uh, creating more the big relationships with the guys from different schools. You know, I knew a couple guys coming in, like Zaid. Uh, we played together at Area Code and stuff like that. But the biggest thing is, like, meeting guys like uh, Vosik and stuff like that from different schools that you don't really get to meet because they're in different conferences. But other than that, it's like the – the town and being able to go out with the family and just you know do things that you don't get to do either down south in Mississippi or uh, in Indiana that's the biggest thing you get the different landmarks stuff like that history and that's the biggest thing that has been fun. So Hayden thank you I appreciate it for your interview and the pregame show continues next on the NCBL Broadcast Network.